Hey guys, Bing here. Um, previously I did a video about Dutch Gable. Today let's model um, let's model another one. So first I'll create a project. So W A some wall and uh, let's go to uh, 3D view. So I'm going to play uh, place some roof. Okay, so level one that's far. And pick wall and uh, make sure it's on the external side of the wall. I'll just select all the edge and uh, give them a over overhand, maybe 450, and OK, and uh, attach to the wall. So now we have a, a hip roof. So now what we need to to do is we need to to have a cut off level. So go to so the e you can use the uh, seeding of, of sorry the so level one and the with offset to um, define that cut off level so otherwise you can also create a new level so for example i'm just going to create a new level i'll just call it um, cut off level okay so cut off so for example here i'll just move it roughly maybe here so now what we can do is select this roof and here cut off level just pick this cut off level apply so and actually as you can see it's not cutting the um, the bottom face of this roof it's not the top actually so maybe what you if you want to adjust this you can just move this level so and also uh, I, I would suggest just uncheck the building story and everything other uh, Everything else should be okay. So now go back to uh, 3D view so we can model uh, the top bit of roof. So this time I'll just use cut off level and then pick line instead of pick wall, pick lines, and then you can just pick one. So you can even lock onto the um, the the edge. Okay, so uh, select these two edge. I'll check the device slope, and also these two. The slope of these two uh, should be the same, 30. So okay. So now if I join them, so you will see that's perfect. It will when these two face are uh, parallel and match. So the line when you join the line will disappear. So probably we we can still lower this a little bit. So if we're typing um, five three, so we can, so you can see so um you when when you lower this roof the roof the 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 sketch of this the profile of this roof will automatically match the lower the cut off um, boundary of that lower roof so which is good so so for example if i uh oh hang on, i'll just do a 3d view here and i'll just open another elevation so wt so so Okay, so now if I select this level and lower this, and you will see it will automatic uh, match. Okay, so which is good. And now let's say um, I'm happy with this, and then we need some wall here. So uh, what we can do is start, just do a wall. Um, maybe I'll change it to something different. I'll just use that generic wall 100. Okay, so and then for this wall, just change the base constraint to the cut off level, so which is here. And then for the top constraint, I'm not too worried. I'll just make it one meter high. Okay, so now and sorry, where's my wall? So sorry, do it again. W A. Yep, cut off one meter high, and then pick this pick line, and uh, change this location line to finish exter exterior, and then pick this this line, either this one or this one, it should be the same. So pick here, 
and actually you, you can see this is sitting on the other uh, outside what you can do is just uh, select it and the space bar click space so it will go inside the roof now what you can do is attach and click on this roof so now you will close off this side and let's repeat okay so click on this wall and the CS create similar pick line external pick this one so if it's on the the other side you just need to select it in the space and attach top click on this roof so now it's finished okay so and let's see if I once again if I adjust the height or uh, yes it's it's okay sometimes this will happen so just what you just what you need to do is because when the reason why this is happening is because when, when we move this level it also move the I'll show you the location of this line so which means this wall is not under this roof anymore so what we need to do is we can just align and align use this face and pick this wall and then you can just uh, it's not yeah this this will happen when you have this wall uh, wider than the roof so so I'll show you so our temporary height is wall so you can see this wall is wider than this roof when when this was wider than the roof when you use attach this will happen so half of the wall attach attaching the roof but half is not so what we need to do is just drag this back to make sure it's fully under the roof and uh, I'll just to use uh, sorry I'll tr see or oh, here as well see this this point which means the wall this wall is stop here so just drag this back make sure the full wall is under this roof so it will automatic um, yeah so it will fix this uh, problem so let's have a look of this one so AL along this face this face and you will see so only half the wall attaching this roof so what we need to make sure both sides is under the roof so okay so that's it um, uh, yeah so and uh, one more uh, shortcut TW so TW yeah so and the WT is offset of WT so this is WT so this is quite useful when you you want to uh, have both, uh, multiple uh, views on your screen TW WT TW okay so that's it um, um, if you have any question let me know I'll see you next time thank you bye